exercise will be the step exercises. So for the step oh, exercises, yeah. ang involved muscles with you, your quads, your hamstrings, your hip flexors, and your gluteal muscles. Ito you're going to use a stepper. Mm -hmm. Natulad nung nandyan sa uh, video natin. Or pwedeng hagdan kung mm -hmm. sa bahay nyo ito gagawin. Yes, Make sure lang stable ah. Kasi meron tayong mga stool na pagtapak mo gagawin yes, yes. yun. Na Hindi pwede yun. So kailangan yung stable talaga siya. Dito sa uh, video na nakikita natin, binababa niya lang yung isang leg pababa. Mm -hmm. Ang isa pang option will be, paharap ka namang ganyan, ibababa mo yung leg sa likod, isusunod mo yung other leg, tapos aakit mo ulit. Mm -hmm. So, ganun siya. Talagang magsistep ka lang. Okay? Yan. And then, make sure that you keep, uh, to develop stability, you hold on you step on one leg and slowly go down. As I was saying, kahit kanina pa, kailangan slow. Kasi kung mabilis, useless siya. Mm -hmm. So, the, the slowness of the movement helps. What not to do would be, you do not lock your knees during this exercise. And your knee should be slightly bent. So, if you're going to check, pag inangat niya yung right knee niya dito, hindi yan fully extended. May slight bend rin siya. <clears throat> Next would be, the chair dip. So, I'm pretty sure a lot of you have already done this exercise. Yung chair dip naman, yeah. make sure na hindi dadaos dos yung chair sa likod. Ha? So, pwede kang maglagay ng chair uh, sa may wall uh -oh. para stable Parang, yung uh -oh. chair. You hold on to the chair and then you just dip your buttock down towards the floor mm -hmm. like this. Ito, yung feet mo, um, your feet should be, they can be together or slightly apart, apart. depending on your... Uh, Stability. Maganda ito kasi pati arm. Yes, ito oh. pati arm muscles mo, core. yung core, oh. yung glutes mo, at saka yung quads mo affected. May variation dito, medyo mas mahirap. Yung isang variation is oh, idediretso mo yung isang leg. So let's say, iba, ah. na, ang left leg mo nakababa, naka-straight yung ah. right leg mo, bumababa ka on one leg. Oh my God. So yun, pag medyo mas gusto mo pa ng mas... Challenging. Challenge, oh. Kung yeah. sanay ka ng ginagawa to. So, umpisa, ganyan ka. Then, pag malakas na yung arms mo, tsaka yung legs mo, next time, idiretso mo yung isang leg. And then, you do on the other, the opposite side also. Now, make sure that you don't, if you're doing the leg extended, don't bring the leg up more than 45 degrees from the floor. So, hindi yung nandito na sa mukha mo yung leg mo. And then, you don't lean too much backwards. The next one would be the wall squats. Last week, tinuro natin mm -hmm. kung paano gawin yung wall squat. No? So you stand a few inches away from the wall. Make sure, again, that the back is flat against the wall. And you just sit down. Now, when you sit down, you don't go below the knee. Mm -hmm. Hindi masyadong mababa dapat yung pag-squat mo sa wall. So making sure na parallel sa floor yung thighs mo. Mm -hmm. And your feet should be about hip-width apart mm -hmm. for stability also. And again, you hold it down. Hindi yung pagbaba mo, angat, baba, angat, baba. Useless yung ganun. Dapat slowly go down, hold it down there, and then you go up. And of course, there should be core and back engagement. Yung hindi pagbaba yung... mo, Doc Ja, mm -hmm. hindi yung all the way down. Hindi. Half lang. Half, o. Oh. Uh, hanggang sa yung maabot mo lang yung 90 degrees yung bend ng hip tsaka ni. And then, you can do the stretches also. Quadriceps stretch. So, palagi na natin sinasabi yun. Yung stand on one leg, tas you pull the, uh, the other leg back. You feel the stretch on the front part of your thigh. Make sure that your back is straight and the knees are actually close together. Then, the next one would be toe touches. So, you just stand. Your feet may be together or they may be slightly apart. You bend forward and you try to reach your knees. You stretch here your hamstrings, no? And also your back muscles. Now, um, when you do this, please don't bounce. Mm -hmm. Hindi na uso yung bouncing. Yeah, Nakaka, yeah. Nakaka-injure yung bouncing. Then the next one is yung standing hamstring stretch or runner stretch yung tinatawag din nila dito. Eh. So, you stand uh, on both legs. Babend mo ng konti yung tuhod mo and then you extend one leg um, out. And then you bend your thorax or your, your upper body towards mm -hmm. the straight leg. You stretch the hamstrings in this exercise, and then you do the other side. 